Wacom Realty New Jersey is using our Counts app on their site to show the most popular cities um, that they offer properties on, on their real estate site. So this is a widget that is created on IDX add-ons and how it works is it shows the name of different cities on your site and the number of properties you have available. So for example, if you click on Barrington, it will show 20 properties that you have in Barrington and they will be shown in the format of your results page. So it will create a saved link of properties in Barrington and same thing for all of the featured cities that you added to the widget. So let me show you how this widget is created. It's called Counts and it's available on idxaddons.com. You click on the app called Counts over here and if you haven't created a widget, you would click on Add a Widget to make a new one. This is the existing one, uh, but let me show you how you would create a new one from scratch. It's very easy. So you click on Add a Widget, and then you decide whether you want to show save links or cities. In this case, they chose cities, and from this dropdown, they started typing in cities and adding them in. So. If you want to add these three cities to the widget, you would add them in and click on save. Now let's try the same thing for saved links. And what this does is it allows you to showcase your IDX broker saved links. The ones you have available here on design, website, and saved links can be shown over here. So if you click on saved links, it will show the saved links that you have and you can click on any of them to create a widget of properties in these saved links. Click on save and what it will do is it will create these three sections here instead of cities and it will show the number of properties in the saved links and people can click on them the same way as they could for cities. So in this case they added in these featured cities and you can also edit this Add more cities, delete cities, and click on save when you're finished. Once you're ready to add the widget to your site, you will click on this button and it will open up a code snippet. You can decide whether you want to show results in a new tab or not. So when you click on a city, if you want the properties to show up in a new tab or not, and you can copy this code and add it into your site and it will show the cities wherever you want to show them. So you copy the code snippet and then if you want to add it here on your WordPress, Wix, Squarespace site, you would just paste the code there. This is a website built on Squarespace so they would go to their Squarespace dashboard and where they have their website add in this code. If you preview this code on a code um, runner like JS Fiddle, it will not show the format. But this widget is programmed to take in the fonts from your site and the colors from your site. So if you copy the code, paste it on your site, it will automatically add in the fonts that you're using and the same background color for these cities. So it will not be showing this format, but rather the format that you have programmed on your site. This is the Counts app available at idxaddons.com and free for Realty County clients.